So I'm not a big, huge fan of like self-help, but I've got some things going on in my brain today that need to kind of like get out or somebody, I don't know. Anyway, but um, I there's this TED Talk that I really like, that I've liked for a really long time. And I'll put a link for it in the bio because the talk is amazing, but it's about um, fake it till you become it. And I, and I've been thinking about that because sometimes people, this sounds very arrogant, but sometimes people look at me and they're like, Lise, how do you just make it okay? And the truth is I fake it hardcore all the time. Like if I'm feeling rough or than regular, then I'll up my makeup game that day because I'm going to fake it that I feel good and I feel better. Or, um, if I'm feeling a little less than, you know, my fabulous, fabulous self, then I'll wear a skirt just because I can fake feeling that way until I can actually become that for the day because it, it actually works out for me that I, I can become what I'm trying to be for that day. And so as I, as I think about the way that I live my life, which is, let's be clear, a hot mess and nobody has ever asked me for how, how I make it work. Cause I, I mm, barely making it some days, but my best advice is faking it till you become it. And that means that I, I fake sometimes the feeling of, I'm so happy to be here, even when I don't really want to be there. Or I fake the, yeah, I did. I did get dressed to come out today. Or I fake the, I'm so excited that you're telling me about the macaroni sculpture that you made because I can't handle it right now. But I'm, I really am happy that you made that macaroni sculpture thing paper for me and all the glitter that goes with it. And and I think that that's okay because by the time I'm done, usually I've become that thing that I'm trying to be. And so my thing for today is just fake it. Fake it till you become it. And sometimes it's hard and sometimes it's ugly and sometimes it feels unnatural, but it works.